Hey everybody, what's going on? Your host AMF1534 here. Welcome back to Let's Play some more Half-Life 2. And uh, it's been a really long time since we played this last. It's been almost a week now. <laughs> I feel really bad for Gordon. He's just been standing here for five days <laughs> waiting for me to come back. You know, I come strolling in. Uh, hey Gordon, hey, hey buddy, what's going on? <laughs> What have you been up to these last five days? Don't even fucking talk to me about that. Do you realize what I've been up to these last five days? Absolutely nothing! There's not even a TV in this room, you asshole! And what, do you expect me to sleep on this dilapidated piece of shit mattress? No! Before you left, we agreed you'd only be gone for three days. I had enough battery on my phone to last me that amount of time. I was playing Ball King, and I was playing Hyper Square, and hey, I had tons of porn. Hell, I even found three matches for myself on Tinder. Hey, they were, they were pretty hot. But guess what, Adam? They were all fake! <laughs> they were all fake! This entire thing, it's been just a wrecking experience. You know who's to blame? You! I'm just, I'm sorry. I'm really, I'm just really upset right now. You know, you know I hate being lonely. I have a complex about that. Just, I'm gonna be mad at you for, for a little while. It'll go away. Just, you have to understand. I don't, I don't like being secluded like that. <laughs> it's a really awkward way to open this, to open this segment. But you know, everything's gonna be fine, huh? I'm feeling. I'm really excited to play this. We've not been. We've not been able to to get down in the way of killing in a little while. So we'll uh, we'll do that, and it'll be fun. And we'll break open some boxes. Basically, what we've been doing is we've just been kind of just nonchalantly traveling the countryside, just murdering people at every stop. <laughs> it's actually been kind of depressing, really. It's just like genocide all over the place. You're like, hmm, small village? Looks empty? Well, let's scour through and see if there's people to murder. <laughs> I mean, it's not like these people are even guarding anything in here. It's not like they're, you know, holding like a piece of the Triforce or something in here <laughs> that that needs to be heavily guarded. Like, it's just an empty place. It's just like a little, like a little, like a little, uh, like a little checkpoint spot. That's really all it is. It's, uh, it's very strange. But... <laughs> Why is this barrel rolling? Why is it rolling? I mean, this isn't a de there's not like a decline in the ground here. Oh, well, maybe there is. Oh, I don't like how it just... Okay. I'm gonna say, I really don't like how it's just holding the same pace. Like, it's not building any momentum at all. It's just like, eh, whatever. Speaking of, uh, speaking of Triforce, by the way, I've got... This, I totally have a song from, uh, from Link to the Past stuck in my head right now. And it's kind of bothering me a little bit. It's, uh, it's the song for, for you Zelda aficionados out there. It's, uh, it's the song where, like, you walk in... Well, actually, I guess it's the song that's also in, like, the menu screen. Um, but it's the song that plays when you walk into, like, uh, the... When you walk into the cave that has, like, the fairy goddess in there. And it's got like that really angelic sounding harp that plays that. Yeah, that that whole damn thing. Like that's I've had that stuck in my head like all morning for some reason, and I haven't played that game in like in years. <laughs> that's the weirdest part about it is I don't have any recollection as to why I'd be having that stuck in my head right now. I know the Game Grumps are definitely doing a series of that right now, but I definitely haven't watched today's episode, so I wouldn't have, like, any particular reason to be, you know, having that stuck in my head. I love the soundtrack of that. Whoa! Jeez, what the hell is this? Like a crossbow with a molten rod in there? It's so weird. Oh, it's so creepy. I love it, though. I, I really... Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna use it. Oh boy. Hey, check this out! Oh, I didn't even didn't even kill him. I was expecting a nice uh Oh god, oh god. I didn't realize that it was that guy again. Oh god, jeez, calm down. Okay. Oh god. I'm so glad, I am so glad that those things can't actually remove like they can't actually kill you. They just set you up for a total failure. Oh, they're just like, ah, I don't actually want to kill you. I, I want someone else to be responsible, even though they'd still be held as an accomplice for murder. But the sophisticated puppy is playing Terraria. People still play Terraria. <laughs> Had no idea. I thought it was pretty much like a Minecraft or Bust thing at this point, really. But apparently, I was wrong. Okay, let's let's get out of this place. I don't, I'm not really 
enjoying much of what's going on here. I do like that new crossbow, though. That thing's... That thing's, uh... That TJ Strongbow is pretty sick. So, the question now is, where the hell are we to go? I wonder... I know we can travel under the house. There was kind of over here. Oh. We've got somebody, and he's gonna die if I can place this well enough. Oh, damn it. That didn't work. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> that was funny. Oh, come on. I just want, I just want one of these. Oh, well, that's not gonna do... Damn it. All right. All right. All right. I'm not gonna deal with it. I just thought maybe for a second we'd, we'd have a we'd have a shot at having a nice little funny death there, but maybe not. What the hell? Why is there a door over there? Oh Jesus! Oh, I don't like that he's crawling over here. I feel like we have to go explore this though. It looks like there might be maybe like a lambda locator down at the bottom of this. I I don't really know. But we're... Where the fuck did he go? Did he go back up there? Well, maybe not. I don't I don't know. Maybe I'm getting a little bit. Oh, so there's nothing down here? It's just... You lied to me, game! You totally lied to me. Hey. So, yeah, dude, I, I just... Uh, I'm not particularly sure why that's stuck in my head. I love it, though. Uh, that that game has an absolutely beautiful soundtrack. I've actually been, like, kind of sort of getting into those games a little bit again. Like, I haven't played Zelda games in a while. Um, and I really only ever liked two of them, to be, to be frank with you. I've... Um, uh, Link's Awakening for for the original Game Boy was uh, was definitely my jam growing up, and then uh, Link to the Past was the other one. But I never really got into the other ones. Like I never got into Oracle of Ages or Oracle of Seasons. Uh, I never got into any of the ones on Nintendo 64, or any of like the 3D ones. Um, I don't know. I just I never. I just I, I really I really enjoy just the kind of the top down, you know dungeon crawler play style that they like the original ones had. I never played the original one on, on NES either now that I think about it which uh, I probably should at some point. I just uh, I never got around to it. I never knew anybody that had it when I was uh, when I was younger so I never had the chance to play it. I mean there's definitely emulators and stuff out there now but I just uh, I never got around to it. So <laughs> I had another little instant instant memory come flying into my brain just now. Um, this entire area right here totally reminds me of Siphon Filter 2, which, uh, yeah, that series will have to happen at some point. But that's totally the memory I've got right now. There's a level, it's like really early in the game that totally has this. Alright, well, here we go. Yeah! I wonder what's down here. Do you th I wonder, do you think there's like a Lambda Locator over here? I'm gonna check it out. It's probably not gonna be a good thing that I'm doing this, but... We'll see. I mean, they wouldn't have this stuff here if there wasn't a reason for me to come climb up here and find out for myself. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. No, this, this is definitely... There's something to this. Oh, okay, no, we just... Okay, I, I understand now. It's just we went up the stairs and we went out the door. I thought there was going to be something more to that, man. I'm kind of depressed now. <laughs> I didn't realize that. It just took us back to where we literally came up here from. Oh, well. It's all good. Oh, hey, hey. Gosh, whose idea was it to keep that guy in here? <laughs> hey. Hey Billy, you're gonna you're gonna be daddy's big helper today. What in the hell's going on? Why is it shaking like this? I don't like this at all. I have no idea. What is going on? Do I need to like sprint to the finish right now? I feel like this whole bridge is about to crumble. I think we need to go. I think we really need to go like now. I don't think I like where this is going. It's either that or the world's loudest... Oh, that might be somebody, something driving over the top of this. I guess that would be a possibility. Oh, that was just... That made me really uncomfortable. <laughs> it's like, ah, oh, God! The whole thing's coming down! Oh, anything down here for me to pick up? Uh, there is. <laughs> you know, the only way I could pick up one of those things was by injuring myself to do it, but... Hey, it's here. Okay else for my... Yeah, someone playing Team Fortress 2. Oh, cool! We get some, some more Molten Rod bullets for that uh, for that little thing. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, 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 hey. Cool it, alright? Cool it. Oh, okay, alright. Oh, wait a minute. Does this thing have a scope on it? It absolutely does. Oh, yes. This is gonna be tight! Alright, where are you at? Don't 
you worry about me. Don't you forget about me. Bam. When I put this rod in, into the side of your face. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, there he goes. Oh, I hope I can do that to this guy, too. I want to watch him fall. It sounds kind of sadistic, really, but... Oh, he's still alive? No, I don't think he's still alive. He just kind of almost reminded me of, uh, of like, the Penetrator from Fear, where, like, it'll kill a guy, but it'll make him, like, start doing, like, those crazy, weird convulsions involuntarily when he dies. Okay, here we go. Let's... Let's see what we can get here. We've, we're making some decent progress today. The hell, where are we supposed to be going right now? We just have to cross over this thing? Not just what it looks like. Wait. Oh. Okay, this right here, this would be the, the most nerve-wracking thing for me. I mean, A, I have terrible balance from having, uh, from having flat feet, not to mention I have just an, in, just an insane level of acrophobia. Not even, not even, like, any sort of... Ugh. So, did that really stick him to that thing, or what? Like, does it have the ability to, like, <laughs> like pin people to things, or is that just because it shot and went through him, essentially? Oh, well, whatever. It's awesome nonetheless. What a terrible way to go, though. Not even going to be able to have a grave for that guy, because it's not like anybody's going to come out here looking to make sure that, you know, everybody's still intact on this weird underside of the bridge sort of uh, thing we got going on here. So it's just going to be like, oh, he passed through the bridge area? Whatever. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're just going to leave them all here. No harm, no foul. All right, down the, down the stairs. Anything out here? Any... any locating of the Lambdas to be found? No? Virtually no reason to come down here? Nope, not at all. Okay, well, that's fine. We'll, we'll go back up. Oh, do, 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 do. Fuck Seattle! Oh, oh, hey, hey. Alright. Should have known there was going to be people right there. Why wouldn't there be? That guy, that's just, he's right here. I know he's here. He popped his little head out. And now he's gone. Well, where'd he go? Where'd that little sneak go? It didn't benefit me at all, by the way, by doing that. <laughs> that made that way worse. I, I guess it gave me a decent vantage point to kill that guy. I'm getting a phone call, but I can't answer it right now. So, we'll, uh, we'll take care of that in a couple minutes. Oh, these guys are alive! Oh, they're alive! Ah! Uh, Oh, shotgun! Yeah, that's that's how we'll get him. That's how sweet revenge will be will be carried out. Really, really? Okay, I guess I was just a little bit out of range for that. It's all good now, though. Okay. In there? No, nothing that I need. I'm just I really want more of those uh those suit those little suit things. Help negate a little bit extra damage. But, I don't think we're going to be getting much more of those. Better question. Ah, hey, where'd you come from? I swear, man, these these guys in the red, those guys are, those guys are the, probably the more annoying ones. Because they just like, it always seems like those ones show up like after everyone else is gone. It's like, uh, it's like, it's like the super loner girl in high school that like, she'll go down to the mall just to watch the, the popular kids hang out, <laughs> and then uh, like they're up in the food court and they leave her they leave their food around, and they end up leaving to go to a movie or something, and then the girl ends up showing up later, <laughs> like right after they leave and she starts like eating their leftover food. <laughs> like that the scene from Family Guy where Meg does that after all the all the popular kids are gone, she like starts like shoving fries in her pocket and stuff. <laughs> and then uh, the the one like uh, the one, like, employee for one of the restaurants comes by, and he's like, ah, I got of here. And then she just kind of, like, runs away, just with her mouth just stuffed full of just garbage. Oh, hey, what's what's up? Jeez, I don't think these guys can shoot me, though. Oh, yes, they can. They absolutely can. I'm pretty sure that guy just killed himself. No, he didn't. Oh, wait, no, he might have. Yeah, that guy totally killed himself. What an idiot, by the way. Oh, I think we're going to have to use the gravity gun here. Yep, sure did. 
Oh, yeah! All right, this is awesome. Super down to this. Yeah, pump that lovely liquid cheese right into my suit. That's what I'm talking about. What up? Finally. By the way, what a perfect place to stop. <laughs> At least I've got a place with a screen in here for you, Gordon. That way, you know, just in case. You know what? I, gotta, I have an idea. Can we plug this thing back in? Oh, we can't plug it back in? Well, why not? It's not like I destroyed it. We just unplugged it. Okay, well, you know what? This looks like a... Oh. Okay, well, it will be a fairly good place to stop as soon as we deal with this. As soon as we take out the trash. Wow, I didn't even hit him. I wasn't even close. <laughs> that was awesome. It's like, it's like the fear of him getting shot was so great that he's just like, Ah! Whatever! <laughs> I can't take it now! Alright guys, well, we have run out of time for this episode, so when we come back on the next installment of Let's Play Half-Life 2, apparently we're going to be heading up this way. I don't know what... That's a new symbol that I've not seen. A weird little kind of like seashell or something. So, uh, yeah, when we come back, we're going to interact with this, with this uh, big machine here and see what it does for us. So until then, my friends... This is your host, AMF1534, saying thank you guys for watching, and uh, don't watch too much porn on that thing, Gordon. I don't want to have to come onto this thing last and see what your browser history is, so just uh, keep it to yourself, man. <laughs>